Alright guys, I just want to tell you a couple of things in terms of my laptop plans. Um, so, yeah, here we go. As you can see, this uh, the Dell Inspiron 14Z is all packed up in its box with chargers, manuals, everything that was, came with it was new. That's going out today. I'm selling it to YouTube user iToilet9 who lives fairly close to where I do. So, um, he should be coming to pick that up in a couple of hours, well, a few hours, um, assuming he sells his old computer. So, yeah, anyway, it's not the point. Uh, I'll be getting $400 for this um, eventually. So, yeah, that'd be cool. Very cool. So I'm selling the 14Z because I never really, I, ne I just never really use this laptop and I want to invest more in my E6400 because um, this is just, this is a nice laptop right now, so, um, yeah, I just want to go ahead and upgrade and repair this one and make this computer my main laptop. Well, first of all, it's obviously built better. Uh, second of all, it's easier to fix, and, yeah, I just, I want to put more money into this computer. So, I am. After I sell the 14Z, I'm going to be buying a, uh, Samsung A40 Pro SSD for this thing, and I'm also going to be buying a new 6-cell battery for it, so it'll actually have decent battery life. Right now, the battery in it is has only about 40% of its original capacity, so it only lasts about 45 minutes. So, yeah, I'm going to need a new battery, so I'm definitely going to do that. And then the 840 Pro SSD will only be like, I think, 125 bucks or something like that. But, recently, yesterday, I, I did this. You can't see that. Okay, let me get a flashlight. Now you can see it. I did that. Yep, I cracked the bezel. And I also did that. That's another crack right there. Um, I took this thing completely apart yesterday just to, you know, uh, completely take it apart and clean it. And... Yeah, that's what happened. I tried to take the bezel off at the very end. Like, I took it off, the whole thing off, because I'm... I just, I just wanted to clean it out inside. Uh, there wasn't that much dust in there, but yeah, I cleaned it out inside. So, after I put it all back together, the hinges felt looser than they actually were when, when they weren't. They've always been this loose, but it just felt looser to me for some reason. So, I tried to take the bezel off very carefully, and it snapped right there and right there so obviously I wasn't careful enough so rather than just replace the bezel I just figured you know what let's completely reshell this entire laptop let's get a new display bezel let's get a new palm rest and let's get a brand new back cover and new hinges obviously because that's part of this so I just figured well for fifty dollars I've already ordered all the parts I'm going to completely redo the plastics of this laptop except for the bottom because it's fine it's just it's metal and it's not it's only the only damage it has is right down right down there where the paint's coming off but I put some sharpie on it so yeah you can still kind of see that but I don't mind that I'm not gonna replace the entire thing because of that all right excuse me I was interrupted for the thousandth time Jesus I freaking hate that um, anyway I'm not going to replace the entire bottom just because of that one little one little spot where the paint isn't there anymore so yeah this laptop is going to look 100% brand new once it's done and the parts should be here by the 10th next week so yeah I'll be making a complete video of um, I'll be making another upgrades video even though it's not really an upgrade it's more like repair I'm still gonna call it an upgrade because yeah and then obviously I'll make another video for the SSD whenever I get that so it'll be cool very very cool actually you know if I sell that I might go buy the SSD in advance and then just upgrade it now that way all the hardware is done and then all I have to do is replace the plastics and metals everywhere so yeah anyway but yeah after I'm done with this it's going to be uh, one awesome laptop so it's gonna look brand it's gonna look and feel brand new so and then back the keyboard here this, it looks like it's worn, but if you take this and, let's see, I'll clean off the space bar. 
you can see it is a little worn but it's nowhere near as bad as if I have my finger oils all over it so the oils for my fingers make the keys look worse than they actually are so I'm keeping the backlit keyboard so anyway yeah after I'm done with this this is gonna look awesome I have a new core 2 duo sticker up there that I'm gonna put on the new palm rest so yeah so that is basically my plans in terms of laptops the 14z is getting out of here and uh, it's going to a good a good person I know will take care of it so yeah and then the E6400 is getting getting some upgrades and repairs so yeah I honestly can't wait for this thing to get you know fixed up it's gonna be like I have a brand new laptop almost so yeah anyway that's my plans uh, yeah see you later